Thank you. All Hi, right, thank I'm Holly Ferwerda of Belmont. It is crucial that you stop and truly listen to what myself and so many other parents are asking of you today. We are here representing the thousands of parents who are standing up for the health and safety of our children. When you and other health officials or anyone in the educational system that say you are masking our children for their health and safety, my stomach turns. It is the most wrong, evil thing that you could say. If you truly cared about their health and safety, you would not require masks. There is a vast amount of data out there that proves that masks are physically harming our children. They are emotionally harming our children. And they are mentally harming our children. The oxygen levels are so drastically reduced when wearing a mask for just a couple of minutes. And there are studies that have been done on that. You need to look at the actual truth in the data that is right. It affects their brain development. So no, you are not providing a safe, healthy learning environment. You are doing the opposite. I'm sure I'm not the only one with a story about bacterial mouth infections in my daughter with horrible, horrible sores that is directly from her mask. The threat of detentions and making a mockery of one of my children in front of class consistently, do you know what that does to a child? Because I do. Do you even care? We all have stories like this, the anxiety, the depression, it's all impacting our children. The mental health of our children has plummeted. You need to do your job and know the correct data. We live in a society where people talk about doing the right thing and standing up for what's right, but then few actually do it. I challenge you to do the right thing. Right the wrong that has been done by stripping away the choice to wear a mask. It is a choice. Everyone makes mistakes. Some are bigger than others. You have the opportunity to change things, to redeem the situation. It's not too late. Make the right decision and make masks optional. Do the hard thing. I challenge you to step up to the plate. You have an amazing opportunity to bring a community together and strengthen it instead of tearing it apart. Stop being afraid of the what ifs, what the higher ups are doing, furthering your political career, and worrying about the money pleasing. And Adam, real quick, it is great that you were able to make your deci personal decision regarding you. your health your and safety to not be here.